Seahawks at the Cowboys. That's the next wild card game, second wild card game. It's uh, Saturday, January 5th, 7.15 p.m. on Fox. Uh, this will be a massive number, I would imagine, as far as viewership goes. It would probably be, yeah. Get Cowboys back in the playoffs. That's right. Always a big deal. Fox, Saturday night. It should be pretty big. Um, Cowboys, two and a half point favorites opening up at home. Uh, is that still two and a half? I mean, you it's got, two, you got nope, the numbers. It's two and a half, and the total is 43 and a half. 43 and a half. All the totals are low, bro. They yeah. all they all were at forty two, and they've all moved just a touch, except for that Houston one. Okay, that's that's what I was curious about because, like you, I, I think before, somebody in Vegas just woke up and was like, "Oh crap, I didn't make lines." <laughs> oh, everything's gotta, two and a half. Everything's forty two. There you go. All right, so but right now forty three and a half. Forty three. Forty. Man. Three all right, so I am. I know which way you're going. You're going Seahawks plus two and a half. Bingo. Um, but I, I wonder, because I've seen this Cowboys team at home. Like, this is a big spot for them. I think Dak with Amari Cooper. Like, I, Seattle whipped up on Dallas early in the season in Seattle. But that was before they got Amari Cooper, before this offense kind of opened up. Correct. I, I don't think Seattle's going to whip them up. No. While I do think that Seattle can can win this game, I think I'm going to take the Cowboys minus two and a half. Okay, I and and you know me, I've been wrong before. No, and no, and I've and, been you know I, I bet against the Cowboys a lot, and and I haven't won all of them. Um, I'm trusting that in coaching, Pete Carroll has way more playoff experience, and will have his team kind of way far far more prepared to play than Jason Garrett. I just believe that. This, the Cowboys' defense. Uh, so in, in all of my picks, I'm taking who I think the best coach and the best quarterback is. I think if one team has the best coach and the best quarterback on one side of the ball, I'm going with that team. I totally understand. And in this situation, nobody is going to convince me that Pete Carroll is better is not better than, than, than Jason Garrett. And no one's going to convince me that Dak Prescott is better than Russell Wilson because he's just not. I like both of these defenses. Oh, I do too. I think both of them try and run the ball a lot. Yep. I'm going to go under the 43 and a half. Yeah, I think I would too. Uh, the one thing that scares me is if Seattle does get away, they've, I mean, crazily enough, they've put up points when they need to put up points. Yeah. And they've given up big plays too. They've given up busted plays. Oh, they, they absolutely have. I, I think, like, but a, a busted play here or there, it's it's not a bunch. Um, and both of them, I think, are going to try and take the air out of the ball. You might I be right. I think they're both going to try and run I a lot. I just feel like – and, and usually in the playoffs, that's why these totals are low. It's because once you get in the playoffs, you get down to the dick cutting. All the scoring goes way yeah. down. And, and, but, it's, and it's but, teams trying to make the other team make a mistake, mistake. as opposed to you being more wide open – and more, more Almost prone to mistakes. every Seattle game I've watched this year was a 24, 25, 28 ball game. Yeah. And that's what scares me about going under this is I. Because 24, I, if 20 I gets make, an over yeah, here. If I get, that's what I was about to say. If I get, if I had to pick it, I'd pick over. So I, I think, I think this, if one team gets to 30, now you're getting too damn close. All right. So you're, you're going over the 43. I'd go over. All right. So I'm going to go under. You're going to go over. I, I see this being 21, 17. Oh, that know, wouldn't like surprise that. me at all. Um, all right, yeah, that's uh, so I, I've got Cowboys minus two and a half. You got Seahawks plus two and a half, correct? Under 43 and a half. I, I, I like, I like Zeke in this matchup. I think Zeke's gonna, gonna do pretty well. I, I don't like Seattle's defensive line as much as no. I used to. No, I was about to say, no, no, they're, and really, I think, they're not nearly as good, nor, nor are their linebackers. So, so, um, I think the Cowboys are going to pick and choose when they go to Amari, they're gonna have to because Griffin will be on him, yeah. Um, all right, so yeah, I'm I'm going under 43 and a half, you're going over 43 and a half. 